Here we go! Oh no! You know, like, while I'm not reading, guys, I'm drinking a bowl of milk tea as well, in real life. If you guys know taro milk tea, I'm trying that out. It's not that bad. I like it. Taro's not that bad. Six six six. Oh no, I don't like the sound of that. Oh dang. Why are you sitting here guys? You always are out, it's quite interesting. Oh no, panic attack. That's not good. Slam it. Listen. Alright, that was the end of the conversation. Move it on. I guess we go over there. Oh boy. The phone. So not playing the sound. Okay, did a quick glimpse.
All right, here we go. It's all blue. All right, it'll start over here. Oh, Nowski seems kind of normal. Let me see. Hey, <laughs> mangas. Yeah. I do like to read other mangas as well, guys, in real life. They're my spare time. I'm like, uh, fun fact, guys, I'm actually reading the Sasuke spin off manga. I believe it's called Sasuke Risu Risuden. And I hear that the, uh, the Sasuke spin off anime is in the boards or something. I didn't watch two episodes of it so far. But yeah, kind of. <laughs> It's kind of great to see Sasuke having like, his own spin-off, but I can't believe it was like, in uh, Boruto animation form. I, I don't hate it. It's alright, but I kind of want like, uh, the regular Shippuden animation version. Yeah, Sasuke is really... <laughs> he's quite badass, guys. No doubt. Just wish he has his arm back. But you know what happened in the end of Shippuden. <laughs> like Naruto versus Sasuke. Final battle. Oh my. Yuri's face. Holy cow. I gotta check her out guys. What's it done? What? <laughs> Oh, that's not good. Dehydrated. If you gotta uh, keep up, you guys. Drink water, you know. <laughs> She's kind of happy. Okay then. You know, Yori kind of reminds me from Mo Mugi and Kaon. You know, Mugi, like a uh, tea. Hi, sweet tea time. Waffle time, waffle. <laughs> yeah, it's been years since I watched Kayon. Ah, I still remember those. Those were the good old days. I still like to rewatch some of them from time to time. Some episodes for fun. And I hear that Bucci the Rock is quite good, but can be overrated. I guess, <laughs> in a good way, it's a best overrated anime show for fall 2022. I'm going to have to check that out at some point. But yeah, the rating beaten has beaten Chainsaw Man rating from my anime list. People, some fans are kind of upset about it, but yeah, either way. Chainsaw Man is actually good too. Man, I think I got a chance to watch those. I've been, I was busy like watching Fruits Basket or something. But yeah, I'm actually glad that I finished Fruits Basket. It's quite good, guys. I really love it a lot. And especially I watched the movie as well. Like uh, It's like a prequel to the beginning of the series. Like Tober Honda, still a toddler at that time. And then her parents still together. The father was still alive. Yeah, it's kind of sad like, for the father right, to pass away from an illness. Man. It's quite tough for the mom. But. Yeah. Yeah, if you guys like romantic anime shows, I recommend watching First Basket. First Basket is finished, I believe. Unless if they decide to make an, another spin-off or something. <laughs> Who knows? But, hard to say. I don't think they're planning on making on the First Basket sequel spin-off anime series. I feel like, I feel like First Basket did uh, conclude everything. Sounded just like a mix of anime original. <laughs> it's kind of nice though. <laughs> Oblivious.
<laughs> we all know that Monica's behind it, guys. I mean, yeah. In a way, right? I mean, obviously. Okay, there you go. So, let's move on to the next one then. There we go. So, 4.43 p.m. Oh my. Here you go. 5.40 a.m. Error. All right. 